Hey, welcome or welcome back to the channel. It's Novella Joy. I feel like I have not posted in forever because work has been really busy. I'm actually on a work trip right now for my regular corporate job, but I knew that I had to get something up soon. And so today we're talking about summer vanillas. Um, two of them are actually pretty affordable and then one of them's on the pricier side, but they're the gourmands that you can still wear even when it's hot out. I feel like a lot of people that love gourmands feel like when it gets warm out, you can't really wear some of your favorite fragrances. However, this summer, I've been loving certain gourmands that I feel like are still great for the summer. And so starting off, this scent used to be my signature scent years ago. I wore it all the time, all year round. I don't wear it as often now. However, it's still a fragrance that I absolutely love. And to me, it's the perfect summer vanilla. And that's gonna be Olympia by Paco Rabanne. And this is actually like my second bottle. This was a backup bottle. I completely like used up my last one. But this is gonna be like a salty vanilla, almost like sea salt and vanilla. But it's not super heavy. And to me, there's just something so special about it, something super alluring about it. I've gotten countless compliments on this. And honestly, you could wear this one all year round, but it's not so heavy that you can't wear it in the summer. And I also think the element of that sea salt with the vanilla, to me, makes this great for the summertime. It almost makes it a beachy. And then it also has some jasmine, some mandarin in here. So it just keeps it light enough that it doesn't feel super, super heavy. Um, but I, I love this. I'll put the note breakdown somewhere on the screen, but this is gorgeous. I would even, I would even say in my eyes, this is a masterpiece and it's not super expensive. So if you're looking for an affordable summer vanilla or like an all year round vanilla, cause you could really wear this one in the fall and winter too. Highly recommend, highly recommend. Absolutely gorgeous, a masterpiece. You can also find this one really, really reasonably priced on some discounters. I'll definitely post a link below for this, but yeah, this oh, is my love. I will say that men really love this one. I mean, countless compliments. It's not super complex, but it is absolutely gorgeous. 10 out of 10, highly recommend. Okay, second on the list is a brand that I've been trying out and a fragrance that I've been trying out. So it's actually a smaller size, but it's Poets of Berlin by Wilhelm Perfumery. This is a green vanilla and I don't typically enjoy green notes in fragrances, but this is gorgeous. So... It's vanilla, but it also has some blueberry and lemon in the top. You get the greenness of the bamboo, and then it also has some orris, which gives like just a slight hint of powderiness. But if I had to describe this, this is like a blueberry lemon cake with a hint of green. So definitely more of a green vanilla. However, if you're not usually into green notes, don't let that scare you off because this is so beautiful. Like I typically hate a green note in a fragrance, but this is so wearable to me and so enjoyable. Now this one is on the pricier side. I believe this runs for around 195. So I would say get a sample of this like I did or get a travel size. Um, to see if you really like it. But I think this one's so beautiful for the summer. It's not super heavy. It has that green note in it. And then it has the fruit in the top. So it's like perfect for the summertime. The blueberry, the lemon, bamboo, orris, vanilla. I think it has some sandalwood in the base, but it's not super heavy at all. Now this one, I would say, I feel like it doesn't necessarily last all day. You might only get maybe like four or five hours of wear. Um, definitely have to reapply, but I think it's absolutely beautiful and definitely a great pick for the summer. Lastly, one that I don't really see people talk about anymore. I used to see people talk about this all the time, maybe like two or three years ago. Not so much anymore, but I absolutely love this one still. 
So this one is Secret Genius by Penrose. This is another one that I really, really enjoy during the summertime. It has vanilla, caramel, and white chocolate in it, but it has mandarin and bergamot in the top, and then it also has a little bit of jasmine in the middle. And so I feel like the freshness in the top of it makes it absolutely perfect for the summertime. There's something like really, really fresh about it. And this one, I actually used to love wearing to bed. So after I hopped out the shower, I would just spray a little bit of this on before I went to sleep. It's like super comforting, um, super comfy, cozy, but not too heavy. And I think that's why this one's like perfect for the summer. Um, you could also wear this one in the fall as well or in the winter. Um, I don't want to say that things are bound by season, but I do think that it's a little harder to wear like a super heavy vanilla when it's warmer out. So this one's like perfect. It's perfect. It has that mandarin and that bergamot in the top, but then it still has those gourmand notes that gourmand lovers love. So yeah, it's like the perfect fresh floral vanilla for the summer. And like I said, I used to love wearing this one to sleep. Okay, so that's it for my favorite summer vanillas. We only had three fragrances today, um, but I definitely have more videos coming at you. I have a vlog coming that I should have edited a while ago. Um, it either went up before this video or it's coming up after this video. I'm not sure if I'll edit this one first or that one, but definitely have a vlog coming if I haven't already uploaded it. And I also have a ton of other content coming you guys way because I'm trying to pare down my fragrance collection into only fragrances that I really, really, really love. I don't want a ton of likes in my collection. I want absolute loves. And so I've been testing a lot of things out. So I should have like some, a BDK video coming for you guys, a Louis Vuitton video coming, um, a juice box video. So yeah, that's all coming up. If you liked this video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share, and I'll see you on the next video.